Treasury Secretary Janet Yellen fiercely defended the G7's $50 billion loan to Ukraine, dismissing Russian President Vladimir Putin's accusations of theft. Speaking on ABC News this week, Yellen underscored the loan's legality, funded by interest from frozen Russian assets. There is no sense at all in which it's theft, she stated, emphasizing that Russia has no claim to the generated income. The G7's decision to provide this substantial loan, led by the U.S., signifies a major win for President Biden, reinforcing the West's commitment to Ukraine amid ongoing Russian aggression. With $280 billion in frozen Russian assets generating $2.6 billion to $3.6 billion annually, the loan is structured to be repaid from these proceeds, ensuring its financial and legal soundness. Yellen highlighted the unity of the G7 nations, who have agreed not to unfreeze these assets until Russia pays for the damage caused by its invasion of Ukraine. Amid battlefield losses and supply shortages, Ukraine has managed to push back Russian forces around Kharkiv, demonstrating resilience in this protracted conflict. Describing the situation as a battle of wills, Yellen asserted that Putin underestimates the West's resolve to support Ukraine. President Biden echoed this sentiment during a press conference with Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky, declaring, we're not backing down, and signaling unwavering support against Russia's illegal actions. This robust financial aid from the G7 underscores the coalition's determination to sustain Ukraine's fight for sovereignty and economic stability.